So the process of faculty member while teaching in the class, uh, you already whatever meeting context you want to capture the mood of the class or you know, just summarize the, their understanding of the concept uh, using a uh, word cloud. Uh, there are various ways of getting it done, but one of the simplest and the easiest one, I believe, would be if you could use the MS forms for that. So let's let's actually have a look at that. So for the purpose here, I have got an MS form, uh, and I think about a situation like you've got a you know, kind of a case discussion. So it is being uh, your position for the grant. And uh, in fact, I'm asking uh, the students, like you know, summarize your views in one sentence, please. There are 32 responses. So now, if you uh, so this is this was my original question, and uh, this is the response I can get. Now I can always download Excel file. I can, uh, you know, view more details, uh, you know, scroll up and down and uh, show it to them. Uh, but uh, it would be nice to have a word cloud. So now that's what we are going to see how to get it done. So here is this small icon uh, that uh, I took up that is a bit. So if you click on it, it shows uh, this uh, responses. And I can also hide details if I want. I can in this uh, response to the question. So let's uh, do that one. So in this uh, thing, so once you pin, what you're seeing here is uh, out of those 32, 15 responses are talking about the increase. So what increase? The next word is price. So I've seen that talking about the price increase. Of course, uh, for uh, the uninitiated, uh, this uh, I mean, may or may not make much sense. But you have been discussing the class, uh, the case, uh, and sure, the class mood is going to be kept, captured. With that, uh, I think we come to an end of uh, this short uh, you know, uh, discussion. And if you need anything, uh, any other uh, things to be captured, uh, do feel free.